So hey guys, we're back with more uh, State of Mind with me, Super Nuts. How are we getting on? Uh, yeah, so last time out we found out that um, Adam and Richard, or Nolan, uh, are actually one and the same person, or at least Adam is, I don't know, the collection of some of Nolan's memories inside a virtual world. So yeah, we found out we're technically playing as the same person. And now we have to try and find a way to bring them together. How are we going to do that? Well, I guess we have to wait and see. So yeah, we now know. Are you successful? Sir, your ID. Shut yourself down. Yep. I need to work in silence. I need to work Sir, in silence. Why don't I say something? No, you may not. Shut yourself down. Got a cloud call. It's me. Just wanted to from Jeff. I'm fine. My name is Jeff. No. Yeah, I, know. Cool guy. I shouldn't do that because it's, it's been done it's too many times. This is war, Richard. Losses are part of the game. What were they doing in Doomsday? They're nervous yeah. because of our campaign. Did you contact Muller? Newman? No. Then do it. You can access the database in your cloud. Hall. Contact Newman. I'm still not entirely sure how. Yeah, what exactly? He needs to look for data fragments. We've already uploaded some for him. They're encrypted. Only he can see them. So okay. He needs to find them and send them to your cloud hub. Begin with a keyword. When you find a fragment, upload it. Keep going until... Until what? Some remnants of intact memory. So yeah, we have to try and piece together some memories. Need me? Improvise. You know him better than he does. Do I? I? You'll be hearing from him. Okay, so we need to connect to our cloud hub. At which point we'll be able to try and contact Adam. Data fragments, keyword. How am I supposed to understand? Will we understand? Hive call. Newman, Adam. That must be him. There we go. Let's see what happens. Yeah, that'll be interesting. That'll be interesting to have them talk to each other, right? Let's see. Why is he just standing there staring at a window? Cloud call service. Welcome. This call interesting. Is currently offline. Please hold. Oh. Closing cloud call. Okay, so... Will he accept the call? How will he bypass it? I guess because he's in a in a in a virtual system. There's a struggle to get him to come on. He's trying. Trying to get through. Here we go. I am you. Somewhat. My name is Richard Nolan. I'm calling from Berlin. Yeah. From where? What kind of connection is this? It's not so easy. He doesn't know what it is. The connection is improvised. You mean illegal, right? This is um, this is potentially. I'm calling because I have reason to believe that. Yes. Uh, is he going to believe me? That Yeah. No, please don't explain anything. Not so Adam, easy. Please. Ah, and he just disconnects. Well, it's not really surprising. I know I've got a call incoming. Hi, Lydia. That was that was quick. I wonder what that's What's for. Up? Nothing, nothing. I just wanted to hear your voice. Okay. Okay, you've heard it now. See you later. Am I disturbing you? Yes. Oh, we'll continue a bit. Tracy is not here, but I'm still disturbing you. Yeah. Lydia, listen, I really have to go. Let's talk later, okay? I feel like. I talked to Tracy months ago. Uh huh. To go now, Lydia. I think he uh he said he wasn't having an affair with somebody. I think he probably was. It seems that he was. So yeah, we made contact, but. Oh yeah, but. He's not going to talk to me. Again. 
I can see that. <laughs> oh, he is. Now. Adam, please don't hang up. Did you receive anything? Some kind of data? Did he? Data, data fragments, uh, virtual constructs. I know it. Wait. That thing in my apartment. That's that's yours. What thing? I don't know. A hologram. Yeah. That must be it. Well, just get it out of my wife's study. She Send can't it. see it. How can I? It's data. Send it to my cloud address. I'll be. Does he know what that is? What? No. Why? So you can take a look at it. At yeah. your data? I don't even know you. Yes, Adam, you do. You know me better than. Mm. There has to be some kind of misunderstanding, sir. Just tell him he's not a real person. He's not a real boy. Goodbye. Okay, so what are we doing now? Here we are at City Five Central. And Adam. Well, let's see if we can get this thing out of Amy's study. No. What do we have here? Richard Nolan. Adam, please give me a call. I have to talk to you. Okay, and Aunt Joan. Adam, how are you? Uncle Jeremy is coming out of his cryo sleep on Saturday. Is that cool? We're all meeting at the Wilson's place. Are you coming? No. Family is important, Adam. Okay, I'll stop. See you soon. <laughs> it shall stop. Okay, so nothing really particularly interesting there. But let's have a look at this. This data fragment. Object ID unknown, possibly dangerous. Please contact City 5 security. Well, let's just grab it. Presumably he's going to see it anyway. Okay, that was... That was different, right? Alright. What now? Send it? From where? From Cloud Hub? Yeah. That's where he said to send it from. Is that in here? I can't remember. Oh no, I think it's the next area. Yeah, there it is. So go to our cloud hub and send the fragments. Send it to me. Hmm. Let's see. Now, is he going to watch it? Warning. The version number of this object is obsolete. Hmm. Obsolete. Object ID recognized. Okay, and now the police are going to come down hard on him. Object sent successfully. Oh, it's gone. Good. Is he going to look through it? That's the question. No, I don't think he is. I think we're going back to Nolan. So that he can look at it. You have new data, from unknown. data from unknown. Data from the unknown. From beyond. The Doomsday. Okay. Decode fragments. Secret, just for you, it said over there. Okay, so what are we doing here? This is... What is this? No, it has to be one of the other rooms. Okay. Well, I can't go anywhere. One of the other rooms. What's this? This is... These are his workmates, right? But it's not that. We've got a drain cover. And again, his workmates, it looks like, but with some robots. That's not it. What's this? Again, we're outside. And then we're in a, a, a... Okay. More things going on at the voice with robots. A guy sitting down. Don't know who that is. A load of people sitting outside that club. I don't think... No, that's not it. don't understand what I'm looking for. It's that Mina person, isn't it? That can't be right. No. Oh, right. I, 
can link this all up. Could that be it? No. Oh wait. Oh, what's this? That links together, I think. That's not it. Wait. That links together, I think. Almost got it. No, that doesn't. That does though. That's not it. No. It has to be one of the other rooms. So it's not this one. Because that all seems to come together, right? I don't understand. That's not it. Okay, that that's the same thing. And I think that's the same thing. That seems to link... No, that's outside. That's the same room. That's probably the same thing. Oh yeah, yeah that's definitely the same thing. And that. Wrong room. But it's not this room. This is my own room, is it? Let's try every combination. That would be right. And that would be right. Okay, that looks better. And that. This is, we've almost got it, he says. There. I should upload it immediately. Uh, upload that. Okay. I'll upload this. And we'll see if this helps anyone with anything. That is definitely an area. It's not, not a room, though. It's outside. Unknown has sent you new data to your Let's see if that makes any sense. To him. He actually did send me data. Yeah. Let's see what it is. Is, sh is this. Sh okay. We're in 2030 now. So we're trying to piece together memories there. And this is Sector 36 at Doomsday. So that's his wife. That's Nolan's wife. Yeah. She lost something. He doesn't recognize her yet, though. I think they're threatening me now. Yeah. Okay. Doesn't look like you're leaving the safety zone. Okay. It doesn't look like we can do anything there just now. What's a, what's in the dumpster? If they threw it in the trash, then it would be here, right? Automated dumpster and old property of Central Services Berlin. Not dangerous at all. Hey, darling. Yeah, except there's a dodgy guy hanging around. Hey, I asked you something. You leave me alone. Yeah. Why don't you come get lost? Oh, get lost. There's that Richard. Oh, there he is. Okay. Uh So, I guess we want Nolan to help us. What's going on, honey? Oh, well, I still lost. She lost something. It's a lucky charm. She's uh, she's hey, lost her lucky charms. 
or you could help her find what she's lost. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm a scan photographer, Kurt's lab. Ah. Nolan saw that card, didn't you? Thanks, but I really gotta go. You should go home, honey. Dangerous. It's dangerous when the club closes. It's probably dangerous when the club's open too, right? Let's try talking to him. Uh, excuse me? What's up? I need help. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is that jacket that he's wearing? Like some sort of uniform. Mostly harmless, like Earth. So we're gonna get Nolan to go and have a word with the guy. Let's go over together. He looks younger. He looks younger. See, maybe it's not the guy he's hey, thinking of. Enough for today, okay? Can't get lost, man. I'm busy. You're not. What are you busy doing? Tying your shoelace. Lady should take care of her sweet neck. Everything here belongs to me. You want me to call the cops? You think I'm afraid of them? We might be. Try and find out. Hey. The. The answer is yes. All right. Can't get lost. And she's not going to find it, then, though, is she? Thanks for helping me out. Not a problem. Should I help you look for it? What is it exactly? You mean my lucky charm? A music uh, box. Just music you take that with you to nightclubs. But what's so funny? Well, like a full-size music box. I have to say, sometimes the faces do look a bit weird. Hers looks wire. It's an important music box, isn't it? I need it. I bet you the guy's taking it. Search the trash. That's a good plan. Damn it! Where is it? A cloud call? It's not a cloud call. No, it's it's a. Okay, so ah, you can open it. I see. It's really so it's her, it's her music box. You're right. I'm sorry. None of his business. Anything I could ask you Was it a music box, or is she, is it stuff she's selling? So she has to make a cloud call to her dad. Who's just as grumpy as before? How's mom? Is everything okay? When's she getting out of the hospital? She isn't. Well, I mean, she is, but not. She got out three weeks ago, Trey. <laughs> okay. What? Really? Well, why didn't you tell I think he probably me? tried, right? We already talked about it. He already talked about it with her. Who would want that? I can't remember. Listen, Tracy, you're completely wasted. That stuff is ruining your life. Uh, don't yeah. remember this again. Your mother and I talked about it yesterday. We're both of the opinion. That if you want to fall, then we'll let you. No, they're just gonna drop her. You won't wake up till you hit rock bottom. Like trash. What's that supposed to mean? We've decided not to help you anymore, Tracy. Nice. You're not gonna hear from us, and we don't want you to call. You'll receive. She's not gonna get any money from them. Daddy, you can't be serious. Don't interrupt me. Do a detox. I think he is serious. Job. Take responsibility yourself. Then and only then. Well, why did you phone her then? Not before then. You understand? Are you guys nice parents. Crazy? You want to just cut me off entirely? Take care of yourself, okay? Daddy? <sighs> and he's gone. He just says it's property of whatever. Anyway, we got what we came for. So I guess we can get out of here, right? We can leave Doomsday. Okay, so here she is. She's got herself a job, I guess. A couple of questions, Tracy. Just quick. Our readers love you. Okay, I have a couple minutes. Okay, um. I hope I nothing personal, okay? Yeah, no personal questions. <laughs> Don't want How those. How does it feel to be the voice's new station avatar? How was the scan? 
She's so she was the avatar of the station. Fantastic. Now I can load my youth craze onto my avatar and grow old in peace. Not <laughs> that I'm in a rush. <laughs> was that funny? I don't Next don't think it was. Tracy, the voice Boston here. The voice Boston. Are they all from the same? How do you stay so fit? What's your secret? Um. Yeah, don't don't stress out too much. What do you mean? To stay yourself, to keep under control, or do you use other ways to find yourself? Sometimes you have to look in a mirror and then you can find yourself, right? I mean, you look in the mirror and there you are, and you just go, "Oh, I found myself." I thought I'd I thought I'd gone missing. Are you certain? You don't put anything else in there? I've answered your questions. These this these are starting to sound a bit like personal questions to me. Okay. East, West. Yeah. I want to be there for all of my fans. And as station admin, she can't pick and choose sides, right? Isn't that attitude extremely naive given the current situation? Next question, please. And yeah. More to politics. There are rumors that your parents have excuse me. Miss Dawson will not Yeah, I said that right at the beginning. I said no personal questions. Bang. Personal question. Yeah, we said no personal questions and you just ignored it. Her bag, she needs her fix. She needs to get her fix. Oh, everything's all blurry, Luke. Must be some kind of VR. Must be all of this have to do with VR. VR. So where'd she leave her coat? Where's the coat check? Oh, it must be here. Because I can see some coats in there. She needs her fix, you see. That would be my guess. Oh, she's, uh, she's losing it now. No, it's not there. Oh my goodness, what's happening? There's another ton of rooms full of stuff. Could be anywhere, it's like a maze. It's a maze of coats. Nada. There's, what, what, there's one that's appeared behind me that wasn't there before. Should I keep going back? I don't know. I guess we're going up this way. Oh. What have we got? Hey, are you okay? You look kind of worried. Yeah, you look a little pale. Mm -hmm. Come on, take a seat. I oh, it's this guy again. Can I get you a drink? Walter, cut it out, okay? What's going on? For this. Let me take care of the lady. Again. I apologize. Sometimes my colleague overestimates me. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Come on, Walter. You have to write in my edits, don't you? Oh, fine. A nice conversation we'll between these people. Overestimating Good. Now we're rid of him. But that wasn't very nice. Ah, it's Walter. He can handle it. But he's right. You look pale and you're shaking. Can I help you? My bag. My bag is gone. It was just here. It was lying on the table. What does it look like? Like a bag. Black with a gold lock. Was there something valuable in it? Okay. It's not in here. It must be somewhere else. Okay, so her coat is not here. Where else could it be? Tracy, I believe this belongs to uh -oh. you. Yes. Oh, thank God. Well, is that supposed to be? And my assistant found it. It was lying upturned on the floor. What is it? Tracy, this is Dr. Kurtz. Director of Kurtz Institute. What is it? Tracy, I'd like to talk to you alone for a minute. Excuse me, but we were just... I didn't ask you. I asked Tracy. Yeah. Hey, wait a minute. Don't take that tone with me. Well, he can do that if he wanted, can't he? You know who I am. I do, actually. And I believe your boss is waiting for you. Richard, can you come here, please? 
This is a joke, right? No. Fine. I don't think it's a joke. Tracy, I have to go. Maybe we'll see each other again later. Richard, coming. Why is he? Oh, sorry, we have to go. I've arranged for your sky whale to wait. Sky whale? What that I do for you? I've been observing you for a while, Tracy. You were wonderful, perfect. I have some what's, interesting What's he doing? What He's got some interesting what's... work for her. Do you mind if I turn your bot off for just a second? Wait, what? He just turns you can just turn any of them off whenever he wants. Do do that? I know the kill switch frequencies. I designed this. <laughs> Tracy, I'd like to have you on board for a project. A genetic, genetic exploration. exploration. You need not worry, it's completely safe. And you would be doing science a big favor. So what's well paid? <laughs> I wouldn't worry about that. Come visit me at Kurt's Labs. I will tell you all. This guy you. seems a bit creepy. Uh, let me consider it, okay? I'll call you. Do. And the robot is now oh, free to. We are late. We have to go, Tracy. Okay. We have to go. See you soon. Onto our sky whale, whatever that is. Okay. Right, so he's now overloaded with information. What the hell was that? Too much information. Final answer to the call. Adam, thank God. So, can we talk now? Y yeah, yes. probably. I have a couple of questions. Questions. Sure, sure. About that data you sent me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I didn't really send it to you. Did you? Yes, that's right. It's a a piece of data from my life. Yeah. How can I experience it? Because we're it? technically I the same person. To a database. But the data is encrypted and virtual. The data can only be played virtually where you are. <laughs> okay. Yeah, mate, you're in a virtual world. Uh, where are you, did you say? In Berlin. And the physical world. Reality, the physical world. Uh, I don't know a Berlin. Is that like a so, VR or something? So, okay. It's reality. Your city is a VR. Yeah. Oh, but, or is it? My city is or real. is it? You're not real. Mm -hmm. Okay. That is insane. I'm hanging up. Adam, you have a family. So right? now we start Just looking like for clues you. that show. Yes. And I have to take care of him. John, my son, he isn't doing too well. No. That's terrible. What's wrong? You can't see him. Oh, no, wait, no. Clinic it's day. not John Cena. Is he sick? He's upset. I had a cab accident. Accident. His mother isn't here. She's working. What happened? What Crashed. Remember. He doesn't have that memory either. An accident. You didn't have an accident, Adam. These are echoes from my memory. They've probably been modified. Modified memories. Accident. You understand? It was horrible. Tracy, she she was with me in the car. Uh-huh. Tracy? And is she still alive? Does the name mean nothing to you? My wife is called Amy. Yeah. There was a Tracy. Yeah. In, that Tracy? in the memory. You saw Tracy? Where? When? Talk to me, Adam. Tell me everything. Did Tracy say anything? Did you notice anything? Yeah, it was from the past, though. Kurtz. Dr. Kurtz. In a wheelchair? Raymond Kurtz, yeah. And? What does he have to do with Tracy? He said something Tracy about... Kurtz were talking. He wanted her for a project. A genetic study. Yeah. A genetic study? Nothing else? No. That's all around, really that he said. Somewhere. Listen, I don't think. Send it to me. The more fragments you see, the better. Sorry. Yeah. He has to talk to. Uh, oh, just a hive call. A hive call. Just a just a random person. I don't know. Some guy called Richard. Yeah. Just someone who's difficult to deal with, understandably. Does that do anything, though? Do I have to do this whole walk his son to the doctor's thing again? Or do we do something else? I wonder. Maybe Walt 
Doctor isn't that crazy yeah. after all. Okay. So what we need to we can now switch between Richard and Adam. Right? And how will I know when when it's a good idea to do that? You have new cloud messages. Turn away from the wall. It's telling me how to move around now. Hey Richard, it's me, Jennifer Jenny. Collins. Call me back, okay? Okay. Do you know what, Richard? Screw you. Have a nice life with your model. What? What model? What the hell is she talking? Oh, she's talking about his wife. I wonder. Maybe there's something to be seen in this. Or not. Probably not. You know, we're told that this is his... Oh, here we go. Hi, Steve. Incoming call. How was it in Doomsday? Did you clear up your expiration? More or less. Yeah. What about that man in my apartment? Did you make progress with his... Yeah, who is it? Okay, Richard. Listen to me. I, I don't know if it'll help you now. Well, tell me. I put his movement profile in the move scan. Yeah. Who is it? I don't know. Yeah, for some reason, so it can't find this guy. Match. I thought movement profiles were unique, like fingerprints. Yeah. Well, if you ask Usually, me, this whole move scan stuff unless you were a robot. I know you have a lot on your plate. In which case, your walk would be specific with. and probably not, uh, yeah, sure. probably not it's documented it's in the same way. Some sort of. Robot, Android. Can I get some food? The following ingredients are missing to assemble. I have no ingredients. Honey, wheat, palm oil. Great. So he can't feed himself because he doesn't have a couple of ingredients. It's just the world map. I don't need to look at that. I don't know what else really there is to do right now. So I can switch over now if I want to. Seems like I need move scan, but that didn't work. Okay, so I can change characters. Now I don't know if there's anything I need to do right now. Maybe there is. Let's take a look. See if there's anything we can find. If we know that Kurt spoke to her, then I would imagine we want to, we want to, um, to go and visit him, right? I can't call his, him, can I? No. Oh, Jennifer wanted to talk to me, didn't she? Hey, Jenny. Thanks for the message. Here I am. Richard. Thanks for calling me. No. Nothing. Steve is helping out on very thin. Yeah. Listen, Richard, I wanted to apologize. What's the apology for? That's okay. Neither was I. He was he was angry. Too much for me. I'm pretty exhausted. So are you doing any better? Health wise, I mean. I think it's going to take a while. My memory, you know, okay. a lot has come back to me, but there are also things. Maybe everyone's in a virtual world. Is that possible? Hey, can I ask you something, Richard? No, oh, personal questions. Sure. Do you love Tracy? What does he? There's what the question. question is that? You know us, Jenny. We have James. We're a family. No, that's not what I mean. Yeah. Of course I love her. How could you think? Wait a second. Yeah, but you. Are you in contact with Tracy? Is this her idea? <laughs> what? Oh, here we go. Paranoia. That's what's going on. No. What? What do I know? Maybe she wants to know if it's worth coming back to me. Or maybe she uh, if you're going to be like this, it probably wants isn't. To make me suffer. Richard, or she probably wants you to oversee the breakup. Tell me she's leaving me in stages. Hey, are you completely insane? Yeah, I think you're you might. He's losing you're something not anyway. Because you care about me. <laughs> okay, Richard. Is this just too stupid for me now? Oh yeah, for me too. <laughs> you really need to see a doctor. Doctor Kurtz. Let me know when you're I mean, uh yeah. Let her know when I'm feeling better. Is this the guy? Bob took your job. Where did you work? 
<laughs> in a box factory. What? The robots make themselves now. Oh no. Self awareness. But I needed something catchy for the sign. Just giving him the only food I have. Thanks, sir. You're a saint. Right, well that's nice. And it was nice that we gave the guy something, but it doesn't really help me right now. Our future. By being a Martian colonist, I guess we Anyone down this alley? Not today. See, I don't really even have any idea where I'm supposed to be going. I'm supposed to be uncovering the secrets of what's happened to me, but... Well, maybe I can use... Maybe I can go somewhere. Big pack? Big pack, ah, at least someone's keeping this business alive. Big pack of what? Didn't you leave for Mars? Make a new start and all that? Did he? Didn't say that. Okay, so we got a big pack of something. Can we go anywhere here? Were on board, to the Get in. Steve is still at the voice. In okay, we need to visit Steve then at the voice. Okay. Not Kurtz. I thought we could go to Kurtz Labs or whatever. I guess that's not what we're here for. We're here to see Steve. You know, from from Minecraft. They could do a mod and Steve could be the guy from Minecraft. I have okay. to talk to you, Steve. You yeah, talk now. Yes. I I think I have some real problems. Real I problems? I knew that already. He got a phone call, right? Can't stay away, huh? Hey, Richard, listen to me. Okay. I want to talk to you. Okay. Not talk to me then. Come with me. He's gonna hit me because I was shouting at his wife. Or he's going to tell me that he's not wanting to help me anymore. Either option wouldn't be entirely surprising. So we're at the West Plaza in Berlin Central. We've gone to like a cafe. Verga. Is this about Jennifer? If you know already, or Virga. Why didn't you come to me? Well, I thought time heals all wounds anyway, right? Does it? You snap at my wife. Blame her and accuse her with crazy conspiracy He's going to drop it. He's not going to help you. You can just sit and, and wait it out? I don't know what came over me. Well, I, I came and told you pretty much a few it's minutes after I did it. You can't imagine what I... I don't care about all that. No. Whatever happened to you, it's no excuse for attacking your friends. You don't have that many. Yeah, well... Like this, you'll have even fewer. Steve, I'm sorry. Yeah, what else can I say? Tell Jenny. What about the research? Will you still help me? No. Steve, please. You have no idea what I you just cut it out. You had an accident. Had an accident yes, and he gets it. But you also had a life before your damned accident. You should try to get it back in order. Yeah, well I have to do this investigation. Listen. I will help you, but I'm doing it for your family. For Tracy and the kids, okay? Okay. Okay. Whoever you need to do it for. Come with me. Okay, where exactly are we going? Find, your family. Find them where? That's the question, right? Where exactly are we going to find them? They got up and vanished. Look, they didn't come out the front door. They just got up and disappeared. They're mysteriously gone. This, this is probably the perfect time for us to do a little jump to Adam, right? I would imagine. Okay, Steve. Are there any move scan results? You know we can both go to jail for this, right? Let's start with the best matches. Okay, let's see. Ninety nine point six. Oh, That's a pretty good match. Ninety nine point six percent. This might be it. Jack Oster. Eighty two percent. Eighty four point three. That one. Christos something. Eighty nine point six. Profiles one by one. Would you look at the profiles? Uh, da, da, da. Uh, 
Sounds only Istanbul. Athens. Christos Pelurus. I put them back. Oh, there's one. Peter Curtis. My best match so far. Put that one away for a moment. Let me just see if there's anyone else. Peter Curtis, illegal possession of narcotics, intent to distribute illegal hey, narcotics. Slow down. We should look at the Remove that one. one. Uh, who do we have here? We have Oni Yilmaz, uh, known aliases Robin Good and Peter Blake. Data theft and illegal cyber activities. Okay. Interesting. I wonder. This this is something. Right, put that one back for a moment. Right, where did he go? Is that him there? Yeah, pop that one there. That's the most And that is Peter Curtis. All right. Now we only need the cloud contact. That would make some Yeah. Uh Peter Curtis. Doesn't have a cloud contact. But is also known as Stanley Wright. Bang. There. That's Let's try him. Bang, we got him. He's from here, see? And he's from Berlin. Okay. Makes the most sense then, right? The video. Yeah. You could easily you could easily change your appearance though, right? Something else, Steve. Do you have any material regarding Kurt's labs in the archives? Don't tell me you're starting with Well, apparently he had something to do with something. Sure. That's what Walter said. All that stuff was with him. Has been for ages. I see. I need to see Walter. I have no idea what he, what he's been doing since he went solo. I wonder why that was. Well, I should talk to him again. Yeah, if you get the chance. If you get the chance. Can we speak to? Stanley, my name is Richard Nolan. Yeah. Nolan? From The Voice? That's me. Yep, that's me. How'd you get this number? <laughs> of course. You're a journalist. Yeah. What do you want? A story? Or a nice time? I don't know. I'll ask you a couple of questions in person. A story it is. Sure, why not? Good for business. Okay. Send me your geolocation. I'll meet you there, okay? <laughs> okay. See you then, Richard Nolan. Yeah. Okay, so we'll go meet that guy and see if he's got anything to do with taking his wife away, wherever she went. We're responsible for the attacks. Right, where's this other guy? Walter O'Neill post-it notes and bits of paper. Hey, Walter. May I? May I interrupt you for a second? Is he, what's happened to him? Hi, Richard. What are you doing Conspiracies now? and... Researching. Stop it. We haven't worked together in an age. Do you know the last time you were in this office? It's been a while, I know. Yeah. Four years. That long already? <laughs> so what's he what's he all about? Photograph of what's Alan Turing? You know, at some point, I just couldn't muster the courage to walk in here. I thought you were angry at me. Hmm. You did. Yes. Because. Because he left him hanging? Oh, stop talking crap, Richard. Frank put me out the pasture, and you. And yeah, me you now as well, yeah. More important things Actually. That's not true, and you know it. 
Right, what else have we got around here as we make our way towards them? More files. They're upset that Kurt's Labs. Something about what? Kurt's Labs. Small talk, if you like. How's Tracy? Uh, what's the kid up to? How's your career? These are the problems. What are we doing small talk or not? Tracy and James have disappeared. Yeah. I'm looking for them. Yeah. I thought so. What do you mean you thought so? What does so? he think? Wait. Forget it. He's you a bit mad. Like yeah, I think he likes Everybody to use that as a cover for what he's doing. A globe with a note stuck on it. I need your help. Somewhere oh, that'd be over Germany, is it? No. He'll help you, I'm sure. He fired me. Yeah. Really? Well, Richard, that's how it is. Everybody's I, mm, Yeah, but I'm not sure why he did. That's the problem. More files. Walter, listen. You've done research on Kurt's labs in the past, haven't you? You could say that, yeah. He's Looks like he's done quite a lot. Well, you're too late. There are things in motion that can't be stopped anymore. I don't Wait, what's where? he what's he talking what about? Means? You know, Richard, I've been doing a lot of thinking of these last few weeks. Mm. I used to think life was about finding the truth, getting justice. But what is it about? It's not. No, it's about life. Life and living. You just I don't know what that is he's got in his hand. The correct side. What is the His side, side, obviously, the side he's on. We're all mortal. Sooner or later, we all die. He's hiding under his table. Gravestones, bunch of people. So that no one can see him. Okay, and there are always two sides to every story. Of course, there are. Yeah. And the other. Life and death. True and false. One and zero. <laughs> you know. A binary system. You understand? <laughs> Actually, not at all. <laughs> You're just taking your first steps. Frank's right. You're actually insane. When you look into the mirror, Richard, mm. what do you see? Walter, listen. What do you think you see yourself? Your well, yeah, I mean, that's generally the idea, right? It's matter. Nothing more. It's not you. It's completely replaceable. Yeah, okay. Okay, Walter. More... Get out more, Walter. Interact more notes about... Random you know stuff. I will get out of here. Very soon. He's leaving soon. That's good. Very good. But not in the Still way you're thinking of, probably. I'd like to come visit you someday. The house? Yeah, but uh, I don't need it anymore. Why not? <laughs> Where are you the going? Great beyond. <laughs> you're not planning anything stupid, Walter. Don't worry about me. Yeah, all right. I'll try not to. Some more files here. More Walter, diagrams. About Tracy and James. I'm worried. Really worried. Yeah. They'll be fine. They'll take care of themselves. And you and I will too. Listen, it's my family. In what way? About. Oh, why? You didn't seem to care about them before. Family, friends. I mean you never had <laughs> yeah. for anybody. I'm starting to get that impression about him. Tracy them. knows what she's doing. How can you say such a thing? I understand that you're disappointed, but you're portraying me as some sort of monster. Is he portraying him as that? Because he's not exactly the nicest guy. These files. Can you even make sense of that mess? They're not important anymore. Okay, well, okay. can I have them then? But what is all this? It just doesn't look healthy. Anatomical studies, neural networks, chemical formulas, mm. architectural models. Creating... What the hell is going on, Walter? Are you writing some crazy diary or what? Maybe. I think Kurt's labs Why? is creating What's the replacement human beings. You, it's not important anymore. That's what you I think's been going on. The whole thing. I don't need it anymore. Body snatching. Well, not quite, but then... is that what it is? Has he been creating? Okay, he wasn't much help whatsoever, was he? There's nothing we could look at there, and there I can only run back and forward. That was okay? kind of worthless. Of course. No, really, I'm coming. Yeah, well, we'll see about that, won't we? Right, so we need to go and see this guy. I don't know what we need to do with Adam right now, but we need to go and see this guy. 
Did he give us his geolocation, I wonder? You know, whatever. Where is he? That's the question I'm asking. Mm. Got some random items there, but nothing of any interest. I think we'll have to travel to find that person. I guess. I, mean, I, I don't know, but I guess. Meet with Stanley. There we go. As long as he does what he's... Uh, as long as he doesn't do anything bad or wrong or dodgy, then hopefully we'll be alright. So where are we? We're at Sector 21 in Electrocute. Obviously, uh... Club where robots dance. And transparent people, apparently, as well. Very strange. Wait, this isn't him, is it? No. Is this guy ever coming? Has someone taken him out? Oh, no, here he is, look. Here he comes. Here he comes. Yeah. Okay, fair enough. Can he even talk? He's finished. Not quite. Yeah. It's about his wife. Someone in a database, and your profile came up. And I thought it was a bit strange. So I thought, yeah, like someone's copying so, your. Who are you looking for? Man from a video, mid 40s. He looks nothing like you, but he moves exactly like me. Mm -hmm. You got it. Well, 99.7% you know, like him anyway. Comes with a job. Maybe you think someone's a role model or something. What, and he's, he's, he's managed to. Completely replicate your entire movement. Do you have siblings? A brother, maybe? Only child. Really terrible childhood, you know? How do you mm. get by if I may ask? With fear. I don't like that word. He I sells experience. experiences. I'm an artist. Experiences. I think I know how that ends. Well, hey, in a variety of ways, right? The wrong thing. If she'd come to me, she never would have crashed like that. Uh... Yeah, what is your job? Virtual reality headsets, is it? He's a virtual reality salesman. Yeah, quite easily. Mm. You can escape into it briefly. They're a representation of a real thing. Okay, let's get back to your movement. Right? I mean, is that not a difference? Maybe you didn't see a man in your video. Yeah, it could have been a telepresence. A telepresence. Valerie scanned me once for a sculpture. Okay. Maybe she sold on the data. That makes some sense. Valerie von Stahl, perfections. You must have heard of it. That would make a little bit of sense. If she'd created. Something like that. I got fifty thousand credits for it and a ticket to the colony. And you want to go to Mars? So you have your experiences in that okay. for you. Okay. That's interesting. For now. But I mean, look around you. That no, that that could be true. Know that. A person who's not a person. But then how was he helping her? Oh, I will. Get on the move stuff. Because yeah, he, he was carrying things, wasn't he? Yeah. Okay. Safe travels. Enjoy. Yeah, as exciting as it might be. Okay, so this other person sounds like she might be interesting to talk to. Right? I mean, that's a telepresence. 
someone who's not a person but is an accurate the representation of a person. In the of okay, the interesting. Oh, phone call. Hey Jeff, made any progress yet? I've made it through to Adam. He's seen the data. Yeah. Apparently Tracy met with. What about Charlie? Has Adam made contact yet? Charlie. Charlie? Who? Your colleague? No, I, uh, we're still working on that. Yeah. Work harder. We need his data. What exactly is your man doing up there? Hmm. He's the servers at the virtual city. This VR needs to be destroyed. Hmm. Yeah, what's he want then? Power, control, saving mankind. I don't care. I know Kurtz. He doesn't think Whatever it is, it's big. I believe he wants to upload every single one of us. I think he does, and I think he might have already done it. We have to stop him. That's all that matters. I think he's already done it with quite a few people. Our minds trapped in some digital limit. Yeah. Okay. How can you be sure this Charlie's still alive? We're receiving his signal. Charlie. He's stranded up there. Okay. You worked for Kurtz, right? Yeah. I'm... How do you know that? I'm a journalist. Yeah. Come on. And you're not telling me, Jeff. I told you already. We don't know what kind of machine it is. We also don't know where your wife. Don't know where his wife is. Doesn't yeah, know what kind of machine it is. Kurtz instead. Sure. Send him a How are we going to talk to him? I'm not dead. I'm in Berlin. Please come and get me. Come on. Yeah. Okay, not so. Not so clever. Same. Not such a clever idea. Okay. Well, what's going on? Is there some sort of police action going on here, or... What? Right, so... We've got to speak to Adam about... About Charlie? He did see a thing that told him to speak to Charlie. Where are we off to now? We need to. The trouble is, we need to. I guess get Adam to trust us enough. Hey, could. Could the guy have been that robot? That robot servant guy? But with a, an image projected over him? Is that possible? Would you like me to help analyze it? No, not really. Do it alone. As you wish, sir. I just thought it might be faster. I'll do it alone. Yeah. I get the suspicion that you probably don't want to. Hey, look. If Kurtz has an ability to turn these things off at will, then surely he has the ability to reprogram them at will too. At what, sir? And not you. But there's nobody else here. Yeah, he's talking to himself. Good lord. Okay, well, we've looked at these documents. There's a lot of documents. Synthetic, biological... Lonely, correct? What makes you think that? Because I said that he's crazy? I can tell by these records. It's like he's he talking to himself. Him. He needs a friend. He needs a doctor. Yeah. He does need somebody. Okay, so now we've got all his documents so they can drive us up the wall. That looks like a floor plan, a lab. Clear about the location. I need more of Adam's data. Yeah. You think he's crazy? Then why are you studying his records? <sighs> to find out just how uh I can't afford to ignore them. I need to check every trace for Just how far down the rabbit hole he's gone. It's not logical. Walter wasn't always like this. He was a good man. One of the best. When Walter mm. had a hunch always a story I understand but you always a story him, is that the correct word what do you mean <laughs> was your friend past tense he yeah, I don't think he's anyone's friend now you left him alone he became lonely and therefore crazy that is logical no it was the other way around he got so involved yeah, well is that why is it because no one would listen to what he was no, saying they're looking for things in there that you could use but that turns out might not have been so mad after all what are you trying to say Forgive me, sir. I didn't want to pry. Yeah, you did. I was just trying to understand your behavior. Uh huh. And do you understand now? Yes, sir. I do. Good. I guess. <laughs> I guess that's good, right? 
I want to check something actually. Okay, so we got a lot of documents, which don't really help us that much. Oh, I can get on my cloud tab again. Valerie von Stahl, or von Stahl. Let's find out who she is. If she exists. Valerie von Stahl, perfectionist. Von Stahl and Kurtz. Oh. Now that's interesting. To be put in She's interested in, in human perfection, and he was interested in the opposite, so if she could make a perfect body, if she could make a perfect body, and or teach him how to make something that we could pass as human. Mm. But she's in cryostasis, apparently. That's interesting. I think we need to switch to Adam because the the game's telling us to. It's telling us we have to switch to Adam. Well, let's see if we can find anything out. This is Adam Newman's apartment, okay. and someone's at the door. There's somebody at the door. There's somebody at the door. We're about to be raised. Good morning, Mr. Newman. It's a is robot. Ready? Morning? Ready for what? You had to go to the doctor. But I wasn't to go with him. I remember seeing that somewhere. Right. John. And they just send like faceless robots to his house. Back. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Come, buddy. Come with me, little robot. How does he Wait, what what? He's not actually a robot, is he? Maybe he is. Maybe he actually is a robot. Your work day at the present will begin shortly. Well, okay, so I have to go to work, is what you're saying. Just make sure there's no strands of excess data hanging around. It looks like I can use my cloud hub. I should get to work. But we're not using it because we have to go to work. Okay, well, his workplace is outside. But that's going to be where we're stopping for today, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed watching more uh, State of Mind. And we'll be back next time with a bit more to see what happens when Adam goes to work. If you've enjoyed that, please feel free to hit that like button. Maybe add a subscription. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye for now.